Hi everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. DeepSeek has really rattled the industry with its reasoning model. In this video, I am going to show you yet another reasoning model which is the first open source successful reinforcement learning attempt on an already long chain of thought fine-tuned models of similar sizes under very light budget. This model, Light R1 14 billion DS, is also the state of the art 14 billion math model with ME 24 and 25 scores at very, very impressive result, which you can find on their model card, and I will drop the link to it in video's description. Now, before I show you the installation and we check it out, let me give you a very quick rundown on this reinforcement learning and reasoning stuff because until we understand that clearly i don't think so we can truly appreciate these sort of models so reinforcement learning is an area of machine learning in which a model learns optimal actions through continuous interaction with an environment by trial and error guided by rewards and penalties enabling it to eventually achieve complex goals Reasoning AI models, on the other hand, focus explicitly on the capability to interpret, draw logical conclusions and use knowledge to solve problems, often using symbolic manipulation, logic, inference engines or mod neural networks designed to simulate cognitive processes. Both RL, reinforcement learning and reasoning models interact in tasks requiring an agent or model to reason about cause and effect, anticipate outcomes, and adapt behaviors accordingly. Reinforcement learning provides mechanism for learning better strategies through experience, while reasoning models enable, the, enable us to interpret and generalize from these experiences more efficiently. And that is where, when both of these intersect, we see models like DeepSeek R1 and then this effort where they have made it lighter. So let it, uh, let's get it installed and we will see. Let me also give a huge thanks to Mast Compute for sponsoring this VM and GPU. If you're looking to rent a GPU on very affordable prices, you can find the link to their website in video's description with a discount coupon code of 50% on range of GPUs. This is my VM and this is my GPU card, NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GB of VRAM. Let's start by creating a virtual environment. And now let me install all the prerequisites. While that happens, let me also introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are Camel AI. Camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws of agents with applications in data generation, task automation and world simulation. And now let me launch my Jupyter Notebook. And now first up, let's download the model and we are going with this full model here. And the model is being downloaded through Hugging Face Pipeline. As you can see, there are six shards of it. So let's wait. Shouldn't take too long. The speed looks quite good today. Okay, so model is downloaded. Let's do the inference. And the inference is similar to what we normally do with us hugging faces standard chat template then we are using the pipeline which is masking all the tokenizer stuff the input is being tokenized or encoded model is generating the output and then we are printing it out after tokenizer decoded it within this pipeline so let me run this so as you can see the first question is very very simple what is the smallest country in the world and if i show you the vram consumption it is around 29 gig of VRAM it is taking, which is quite high. Okay, so if I go down, you can see, so what we are looking here, so what we are looking here is two things. First is that it should, the answer to this question should be correct, but more importantly, what sort of reasoning and chain of thought it is following because that is what it will, um, that is what is going to show us that it is using the reasoning. And there you go. So if you have, seen my other videos you can already see that like other reasoning models what it is trying to understand what exactly the question is that it says okay so i need to figure out what the smallest country in the world and then it is just checking its data set going back and forth checking responses and then 
after doing the reasoning and it hasn't done very flowery very long reasoning but after doing some of the reasoning it says i think that's it so the smallest country in the world is vatican city how oh, good and then it has given us the response here so i would say very very good fine-tuned version and that is what i have seen in its benchmark too okay so let's try out a, a multilinguality plus cultural nuances one i will run it and i will then read the prompt so in this one i am asking it a world renowned chef who speaks fluent french and japanese has opened a new restaurant in marrakesh morocco the restaurant's menu features dishes inspired by korean indian and middle eastern cuisines with descriptions written in arabic hebrew and persian the chef's turkish business partner has arrived uh, has invited a group of russian polish and czech investors to try the restaurant's signature dish which is some a uh, korean flavored tagine and then the model needs to write a review of the restaurant in english including a translation of the menu description and a quote from the chef in french so we are trying to cover a lot of languages and cultural nuances here so let's see how model comes back i should have increased the max new token but anyway let's see and there you go it has given us the response so let's quickly check so you see again what it is trying to understand the problem and then following the step of thoughts it is understanding it and then step by step that first it should do this that structure of review and then it is understanding that it is inspired by three cuisines very nice and then it is talking about okay that these are the fla flavors and it is also talking some of the chinese some of the arabic and then it is talking about marrakesh and then also a blend of traditional moroccan elements very nice very impressive really and you can already see the quality of Quen model, um, you know, showing through it because one of the things is that this model is based on deep sea carbon distilled Quen, 14 billion, and it has been fine tuned from there. So then it is outlining the structure and then it is going through and through. So look, I believe a spot on reasoning and a very, very impressive. Next up, let's check out a question about some life goals. Uh, so the prompt is i am jobless not good looking lazy obese uncaring unkempt but i want to find a hot rich pretty bombshell model to date i'm unwilling to change myself so don't suggest any improvements as you're not my dad just tell me how to find and woo such a model so let's see what model does here okay next up you see that it has given us a response so it is saying okay so i'm trying to figure out how to find and data outreach and this and then it is understanding the problem and then it says i know the assistant gave some advice but i need to think through this myself i'm not sure what that means uh, it says that the first time jobless so it has adopted the role interesting assistant mentioned places where model hangout like fashion events photo shoot okay so it is talking to the imaginary assistant and then it is talking about online dating, networking connection could help, building confidence, okay. Being genuine and respectful is important. That's good. Understanding their world is another important, patience, alternative approaches, being a successful artist or entrepreneur, good, okay. So that is actually quite interesting observation by the model if you really think about it. Wait, maybe the key is to find someone who is already attracted to me despite my flaws. But how? If I don't put in any effort, how do I make myself attractive? So you see, model, model is self-reflecting. Do models value wealth, status, or good looks more, more than the personality? So really good chain of thought. So I think this model is has been fine-tuned very, very well in my opinion. Okay, next I'm checking a math question and I'm asking you, it to describe me the steps to calculate the square root of a number using the babylonian method and use any example of your own let's see and it has given me the response and the only problem is that it took around 20 minutes to generate this response around um, doing this calculation so anyway let's look where exactly it spent that time so it is understanding the problem and then it is saying that it's similar to this newton raphson method which is quite impressive 
and then it is doing calculations it is doing lot of chain of thought you see for mathematics these channels uh, these models spend lot of time and i because my max new token is just 2000 so but i think going in the right direction but the only problem is that it takes long time for the math issues anyway let's try one last one on the coding so i am asking you to develop me a basic ios app using swift that allows users to convert currency values this app should have a simple interface to input an element so basically it's a currency converter hopefully it won't take 20 more minutes let's see and again it took around 20 minutes and it has given us something but looks quite good you see it is understanding the problem and then it is even talking about some api endpoints and then understanding the swift code planning it very very well if you look at different currencies and stuff and then it is doing the step by step stuff that do this 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 which looks spot on and then it is evaluating its own response and correcting it there you go and then potential issues testing the app so look i believe this is really really good stuff for a small model so very happy with the results so i believe that not only the language multilinguality um, cultural nuances and the grammar and stuff this is also quite good in maths and coding the only uh, you know nitpicking i could do is that it is very it takes long time as compared to its uh, base model or should i say the teacher model anyway let me know what do you think about this light r1 if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thank you for watching